What's going on, Sagittarius? I literally, as I was tick picking up this deck, I heard somebody's a walking STD. Ew. I don't know, Sag. That could be somebody around you. Somebody a walking STD. Like, they got some shit. But anyway, let me get one more, one card for you, Sag. I know I was supposed to do y'all reading yesterday, Sag. My bad. Okay, um, please like, share, comment, and subscribe to the channel. Don't take that message. That was just, that was, yeah. I have a weird way of, my ancestors talk to me in a different way. Anyway, give me one card for Sag. What's the overall energy for Sagittarius, please? We have distraction. Sub to Q's hint at impending danger, a breath away from potential turmoil in the closeness of paralyzed caution call. Oh, somebody need to watch what they're doing, okay? Or watch the road ahead or somebody needs to pay attention. You see how somebody, this person, she's not paying attention to the people that's in front of her, okay? She about to run these people the fuck over. I was naive to think that feeling, fleeting affairs could ever take the place of a genuine connection. I, have, I should have trusted my heart more than my craving for new experiences. Please forgive me for doubting the bond we share. Somebody could have left somebody, okay? Something could be significant about 321 as well. This could be March 21st, okay? Or February 13th or January 23rd. That could be your birthday or you could have Sagittarius significant placements um, in your chart, okay? You don't have to be a Sagittarius son to be watching this reading. Um, you can have significant uh, Aries, Pisces placements, Capricorn placements, um... Aquarius placements as well. So I feel like, um, yeah, I feel like somebody is just not paying attention to danger or they're not paying attention to something that is headed their way. They're not self-disciplined. They're, they're always tempted. We have exploitation. I feel like, I feel my life is stuck in a rut and I can't break free no matter what I try to do. Things keep falling apart. I wish I could find a way out of this prison. Oh, we... Yeah, and then we have third party. I fear you may be, somebody's falling for a false flame. One that only brings temporary happiness It's a trap. Or there's a false flame that could be trapping someone to make them a puppet or trap them in a cycle of consumption that's never satisfying, shallow. Satisfaction from consumerism is short-lived. Monetary chains hold you back from true happiness. Mm. It's like somebody's trying to step on somebody that's very delicate, nurturing, loving for someone that just doesn't give a fuck. And that's, and that's, and that's, oh, Mary had a little lamb. Okay, Sag. Someone also could be suffering from some type of childhood wounds that they're not healing from behind the scenes. Or somebody's like literally like waiting on you behind the scenes. Okay. We have the moon. Hierophant. Or maybe this is a secret that somebody's married. They're in a commitment. Yeah, the Hierophant of Four of Wands. Somebody's married. They're in a commitment already. 313 on the clock. Somebody's in a commitment, they're married, they live with their person. What's the messages here for Sag? Yep, the Queen of Pentacles in reverse. I told you, look, the Eight of Wands and the Three of Cups. So nothing but fakeness coming out in this reading. This is a fake ass friend or with the Three of Cups, the Eight of Wands in reverse and the Queen of Pentacles in reverse. Somebody's for sure going through a backfire or whoever this is that tried to do a backfire or they tried to step on. Somebody's a, a man eater. I'm picking up a man eater that's fake or they overindulge, they party, they gossip. They could be going through a backfire. Or this is someone here that's like, don't tell nobody what I said, but they would be the main ones like telling everybody. They can't hold water. So I feel like this person's going through some type of delays. You could be dealing with a Cancer, a, another Sagittarius, or a Capricorn here. But I feel like what this is, somebody could have been indulging with this third party. What's the Three of Cups in reverse? This is a fake friend. Yeah, a King of Cups. It could be a Cancer. So you could be talking to a cancer. This cancer fake as fuck. Yeah, this cancer could be gossiping about you or maybe somebody's like getting rid of a third party. Don't know, but you could be dealing with a cancer, the three of cups, the king of cups, or this could be a Pisces or a Scorpio. Yeah, so I feel like somebody's in love with someone that drinks a lot or they have feelings for it. Even if this is not love, this could be just like compassion or they're very empathetic, 444 for this fake, fake friend that parties a lot or somebody possibly has like drink a drinking problem or this is someone here that loves hearing the tea or love hearing the gossip. A King of Cups, Three of Cups does. What's this King of Cups doing? 
Seven of Wands. King of Cups, Seven of Wands. So a King of Cups could have blocked someone, but they did it in a cute way with the Five of Wands. Seven of Wands, I mean, Five of Swords in reverse. So I feel like either somebody has a desire to reconcile with someone that has blocked them. Yeah. Or somebody's holding on to some type of past resentment because they've been blocked or they feel like something is a challenge or... Um, this could be like a group of people that's ganging up on this masculine, on this king of cups because of how they feel. Or they like, man, you stupid as hell. Like you like that person or you you in love with them and they attacked you or you you in love with that person and they've been competing with you or something about that. It's like somebody just being like looked at as like, man, you stupid as hell from going to that person or being in love with them or having feelings for them for attacking you. Yeah. But I feel like, I guess you just can't help who you love, right? What's the seven of wands? So I feel like somebody, or this could be this king of cups finally standing their ground for who they love. They could be talking to this fake ass group of fake ass friends. Like, man, no, I'm standing my ground for who I love. I actually want to, I actually want to reconcile with my person or I forgive my person. And, um, I'm hoping that they forgive me. Yeah, so I'm getting this King of Cups could be standing their ground or they want to fight for love. They're like, nah, I fight, I'm fighting for my I'm fighting for my lover. I'm fighting for my person. You bitches are fake as fuck. All y'all do is sit around, gossip, drink, and talk shit all day. That's why y'all going through backfires. Or this is the reason why, like, this could be this Queen of Pentacles is being slowed down from working to working together with this Three of Cups group. All right, this could be a coven or a cult that's being slowed down from doing magic or doing any spell work because I'm getting this King of Cups is actually stepping up. They're stepping up. What's the King of Cups, Seven of Wands, Five of Swords? Yeah. The strength in reverse. Okay, so they could be feeling a little bit vulnerable right now. Okay, because either they've been attacked or this could be somebody here that's being attacked for how they feel about a person or like, oh, you love them or I'm going to attack your ass. We have the Emperor, the, um, the Knight of Swords, and the Six of Wands. So either somebody feels like they're weakened or their defenses is weakened or it's like somebody struggling with pride, ego. Um, maybe somebody like fucked up and it's like, damn, like it's like I, I let my weakness show or. Yeah. It's like somebody possibly let their weakness or they let their guard down to the wrong people. Now they're trying to stand up or, or have, you know, or, or stand their ground. Hmm. Somebody could be feeling inadequate as well. Or they're low on energy. Why is the strength? We got Leo energy. We have Aquarius. Um, what's, what's, what's the strength in reverse? I feel like this King of Cups could be... Okay, we have the Four of Wands. Yeah, because the Four of Wands in reverse. Somebody here is like losing something or there's some type of cancel celebration due to somebody not being loyal or there's a lack of support. So this could be people that was in the community or somebody's like, oh, no, we don't want you in our community anymore or or because of who you love or uh, somebody doesn't want this King of Cups in the community anymore because of who they love or who they desire to be with. Yeah. So there's a lack of support. And this could be some type of home conflict or somebody's very insecure because either they're losing a the home or um, or whatever. Or this is some type of reunion that's not coming together. I feel like somebody does not, doesn't want to reunite with this person because they could be insecure or they could be struggling with their pride or, or ego issues or they're unloyal or something is going on with someone doesn't not, they don't have any power or any energy or any strength to persevere or move forward or they don't have any like courage or passion. Um, so it's just like, nah, this could be like a false flame. Like I said, with the four wands in reverse, didn't we read, didn't we read that? Yeah, this could be a false flame or this somebody's false flame is very insecure. So this could be conflict with others or somebody's very, very like manipulative and codependent or they're so codependent on the spell work working. But wherever this is, it's like they're like, man, this spell work has to work because I'm losing my foundation. This is someone that could be trying to like sweet talk a king of cups to being with them or even reconciling with them but the king of cups is like nah man somebody's losing they're losing their foundation and this is how what makes them weak the four of wands in reverse this is a backfire somebody's losing a home they're losing support nobody's fucking with this person 
Yeah, I feel like this could have been the spell work that they did, or they could have been trying to cause a distraction to this masculine. Mm. This is the energy that always looks back at the past. You know what I mean? Yeah, they don't move forward. They always looking backwards. What's the eight of wands in, in reverse? Yep, the, the uh-huh, okay. So the eight of the eight of wands is clarified by the hangman. So there's delays. There, I'm picking up major delays with this hangman. I feel like these are delays after delays after delays after delays after delays because of what somebody did, the spell work they did, or they could have been gossiping about someone. It's like now they're being hit with all these delays at once. Yeah, and I feel like they're enlightened about this. They know the reason why they're being hit with these delays, or they know the reason why that there is some type of change here happening, or they may have to sacrifice something or let go of it. Yeah, whoever this is, I'm getting Pisces, Sagittarius, Capricorn, Cancer, Leo, Energy. Yeah, so what's the hangman here in reverse? So either taking a pause or taking a moment to reflect or gain a new perspective. Whoever this is, I was doing magic. Now it's like, I'm picking up something here. I'm, I'm hearing my consciousness kicking in or I'm, I'm enlightened now that I did too fucking much. What's the hangman? Yeah, the eight of cups and the ace of cups. So somebody's like abandoning these delays or they're just abandoning someone and walking right into like, a love connection. Either somebody could be le leaving somebody's text on red, leaving a message on red, or not saying anything. This could be like a lot of slowdowns in communication, and then someone's like, nope, I'm leaving. I'm about to move on to this Ace of Cups now. But this Ace of Cups is a bad idea. We have the full card. This could be an Aquarius somebody's moving towards. But they're going to be disappointed when they go towards this Aquarius because this Aquarius is going through bad karma. The Aquarius is going through bad karma. A lot of people are going through bad karma. And it's like, oh, nope, I'm going to move to this person. They think that they're going to go towards the Ace of Cups or have some type of fulfillment or a wish come true in love. But it's, it's a delay. There's some type of disappointment here. What's the Eight of Cups and the Ace of Cups? Or somebody's leaving something behind to go towards the Ace of Cups because whatever this is was delayed and I'm getting it was delayed for a reason. Because somebody had true, pure, genuine love right here and they decided to play. What does, what does, yep, the Ace of Pentacles, something very solid. Ace of Pentacles and the Ace of Cups that they could be traveling to, Six of cups, Swords. I'm picking up also somebody could be being guided to poverty. Or somebody's going back to lack and poverty. Whoever this is that was living a good life, the Queen of Pentacles in the upright is usually someone that's very practical, nurturing. They, um, they're a good mom. They're a good witch. They, um, you know what I mean? They take care of their responsibilities. They're very good with money and with business. In reverse, this person, they not, they're lazy. They could be a sex worker. They could do dark magic. Um, they could be a social climber as well. Or they could be just like one of this person doesn't take care of themselves. Like this is like an energy that don't really like, um, they don't pride themselves. Everybody. Nah, let me just say this th disclaimer. Everybody don't care about their appearance. Me, for example, and I'm just saying this because I'm a Libra rising. I take care of myself. Luckily, God blessed me with gifts to be able to do my own hair, to do my own um, nails, my own makeup to the point where I don't have to pay for that stuff. You know what I mean? I can do it myself. You know, this is an energy that they don't take good care of themselves. They're, this person could be self-centered and very jealous of other energies that take good care of themselves. Okay, and they possibly try to put themselves in one sided competition. Okay, we have the Knight of um Knight of Swords in reverse. Yeah, and then they wonder why they get rejected because this energy is not themselves. Give me the Queen of Pentacles in reverse. Not only that, are they not themselves? This person is not good with money. They're very codependent and smothering. What's the Queen of Pentacles in reverse? They're not a good mother either. Yeah, the Knight of Cups. So they could be a player or they could be like this is like fuck fuck girl, fuck boy type of energy. Yeah. Knight of Wands, too. Yeah, somebody's like a fuck girl, a fuck boy, or, you know, or, or they're a gold digger. Or they're a sex worker, or they try to charm people to give to them, or they're like, oh, here's my proposal, but I don't have much. So somebody's like a damsel in distress, I'm getting. What does that mean? 
damsel in distress. Is that like a, never mind. What's the queen of pentacles and a knight of cups? We have the magician. I'm trying to tell you, somebody be doing love spells like crazy. Yeah, so that they can have longevity, fulfillment, or so that they can have this windfall or this like, oh, it's like, and then they get hurt. It's like they'll cheat to get this 10 of pentacles. That's what this queen of pentacles does. I cheat to get the Ten of Pentacles. I can cheat to get this windfall, to get the success, because I'm a scammer. I'm a scam my way to the top. Social climber. They scam their way to the top. But this this is temporary. This is a temporary uh, fulfillment. Because now they're about to be stuck. When this backfire is hitting them, oh, it's coming. The Magician, the Nine of Cups. I'm getting, yep, the Devil card. Mm, 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 mm. Yeah, somebody's obsessed with doing spell work. Love magic. On this king of pentacles in my first. Or this is someone that could have been trying to stop this man's money. Or this could be a karmic couple that could be that could be doing this shit together. The ten of wands. This karmic couple are both headed to destruction. This karmic couple is both like um, suffering right now. Burning. They got to work hard. Or this karmic couple may have to move. Yeah, they could be moving. And then we see the queen of cups in reverse. Could be they could be avoiding conflict with this queen of cups in reverse so i don't know man what's the magician and the devil somebody they're obsessed or this capricorn is the magician we have the eight of swords the chariot somebody could be going to jail i'm picking up like a roadblock or somebody's like blocking somebody in yeah with their car i'm getting like a roadblock Mm. Um, what's some things that they be putting like somebody's like going to be barricaded they're not going to be able to use their vehicle they're going to be stuck trapped in one spot or you somebody's stuck or trapped in their vehicle and what's the magician and the devil the ace of wands yeah, somebody's doing penis spells as well. They're doing something. Yeah, justice and the eight of swords. I keep seeing that. Due to somebody not wanting to change, a distorted feminine in reverse. Okay, this person could be playing victim right now by trying to block somebody else's chariot. This person was very arrogant, very careless. I'm getting a very aggressive energy as well. Or somebody could be dealing with an aggressive cop. I'm not, well, I just, I don't know why I said that. Okay. But whatever this is, somebody was unjust or they did something in an unfair way or they got something unfair. This wasn't a fair, somebody did not have a, we have three aces, ace of wands, ace of pentacles, and an ace of cups. All we're missing is the ace of swords. So there's a new beginning here or somebody's new beginning was delayed. What's the Ace of Wands? Somebody's obsessed with doing penis spells. We have the Ten of Pentacles. Yep. It's like somebody, they would do penis spells to gain some type of wealth or somebody could be sleeping with somebody in their family as well. They fucking a family member for money, for finances. And they wonder why this not going nowhere because they fucking somebody in their family. Somebody having sex with a family member. A family member could be a Virgo, could be a Capricorn, could be a Gemini or somebody. Whoever this is, they fucking a family member though. A Queen of Wands in reverse. And this person's a big time hater. Whoever this Queen of Wands is in reverse, somebody fucking a family member, man. They nasty as hell. So some type of incest is going on. Okay. Anything else? Yeah, this this Queen of Wands in reverse is a cheater, bro. And they be smitten. They got legal issues, and they be ugh. Or somebody's messing with your family member, Sagittarius. Somebody could be sleeping with your family member. What's the what's the, somebody's what's the Ten of Pentacles, Ace of Wands? Yeah, the Page of Cups. I'm trying to tell you, and this family member of yours could be a lot younger. And they're not even satisfied. It's like they do it just to either piss you off or they do it to because they're insecure or they're promiscuous. So this could be some type of fake apology. Oh, I apologize for fucking your family member behind your back. I apologize. They didn't satisfy me anyway. So I'm going to make peace with it with the four swords. Yeah. 
The truth is the person that they were, they was sleeping with, they needed money from them. So it's like they met, they match. So this could be like an opportunist get with an opportunist. Or it's like, oh yeah, I'm gonna I'm get with this person, but they're opportunist too, or they're a user too, or a gold digger with a gold digger. Like you ain't gonna get shit. Like, <laughs> so it's like a gold digger meets gold digger. That's what the vibes is I'm picking up on. They're like, nah, damn, you a gold digger. I can't get shit from you because you're trying to use me. And I'm trying to, uh. so game recognize game. And now somebody's like, yeah, nah, I'm good. Anything else? Or oh, somebody just wanted sex. They just wanted one thing. Give me this three of cups in reverse. Somebody could be trying to keep a third party a secret. Or somebody like asked about it. Like you've been sleeping with so-and-so, they want to attack you. What's the three of cups? Yep, something is up in the air. A bank failure. And I nobody want to hear it. About the sneaky snake that goes behind your back. They're deceitful. They're a sw the swindler. Check yourself. A hater. Could be having anger management problems about a fake apology. Yep, they're depressed because somebody's keeping a promise. Mm. What's the three of cups up in the air? Not able to make solid plans. Flighty, ungrounded. Yeah, don't want to hear it. A bank failure. <laughs> Something went wrong in a bank. And I feel like this was some type of delays or setbacks or... Mm -hmm. I feel like they tried to steal this from somebody and now they're mad because karma's hitting them. That's what you get when you try to steal some shit that don't belong to you. What's the eight of wands in verse? Sexual protection. Mm. What's the eight of wands in verse? Fulfilling a fantasy. Oh, somebody's backfire is, is uh, or somebody blocked somebody. Caution. Yeah, I feel like the somebody here is being cautioned not to make a bad choice. Or whoever this is, it's like somebody's going to sleep with someone, pass them something, and then like they're going to block them. Give me Queen of Pentacles. Yep, this hater. That could be teasing you. 2212. Yeah, give me the Queen of Pentacles in reverse. This bitch doing dark magic. Give me the Queen of Pentacles in reverse. We have red lipstick stains. They're a cheater. They could be pregnant or this person could be like, this could be some type of unsure or a pregnancy scare that they could be having. Their life could be falling into pieces. Yeah, because from a bugaboo, they're trying to burn evidence or the bugaboo, they're setting a record straight with a bugaboo and they're burning evidence. This is someone here that's like, no, we can't be seen together. I know we fucked around and we slept together, but no, it's like they're trying to bug somebody else and tell them like, oh, I may be pregnant or I'm unsure. They need to go to the doctor or get an ultrasound or something. I don't know. But a bugaboo could be setting a record straight and they could be burning evidence or they possibly got rid of the baby. Yeah, fighting for what you love, claiming what's yours. Love is a battlefield. So this person is like, yeah, investigating. Somebody could be going through somebody's phones, mechanical, going through the motions, checked out, routine. Somebody's going through somebody's things. They're going through their phone. Mm -hmm. Whoever this is in this toxic relationship because they're insecure. It is that it's like somebody's insecure because either you want to start over or you're moving on or the ex is back or... They want to try this again, but they could be selling you a dream. Tries to sell you a pipe dream, no substance, and evasive. Yeah, about their past. Or somebody has a secret past. So it's like they're trying to distract you, Sagittarius, or whatever. But I'm going to leave it there, though. Like, comment, subscribe. Turn your notification bell on so you will not miss any of my videos. Hopefully, I was able to give you guys some messages that you need right now at this time. Um, Sag, and that's all I have for you.